And we need somebody to talk for us, to be able to tell us, tell the government, we are also children of this country. We also deserve a fresh shake since 1994. We were first class citizens in 1994. Now we are being treated like second class citizens. Somebody would say, no, this fellow is talking nonsense. You read it in every day's paper. You sit in your homes, you don't have to read the paper. We're not getting jobs. We're not getting into universities. So keep that in your prayer. Think about what I said. I know full well. On Friday, we will start a register. We want your email address. We want your name and your email address. And on Sunday, we'll continue that process. So that we can also build a database. And when we speak and say to somebody, you're talking nonsense. We are not Indians. We are Africans. We were born in this country. We are black according to the Constitution. Why would you separate us? Every one of our parents standing here today will tell the children, you can become the best that you can. Am I right? Yes. You motivate your children. And when we go out there looking for the job, the fellow who got D can become a doctor, and your child who's got A can't become a doctor. So when you go for a finger operation, the fellow's going to pull your teeth out. That's what's going to happen. I'm making light of it, yeah. But you get the point. So now when we raise the flag, put your arms together. You're not only praying for yourself, your health, and your prosperity. You pray for all of us, especially your children. <laughs> right, Guru? You ready? When I speak, don't speak to that person. Listen to me. After that, you can speak to your children. You ready? So we waited for everybody to come down. Our prayer coordinator will help and guide you through this process. I've done my part. Somebody lost a cap. You know, lost a gold earring would have been more better for us. But you lost your cap. Anybody has a cap? There's no money here. Though. Right, so let's go, go into this play in all earnest, earnestness and, and, and sincerity. Okay, dear devotees, once again, on behalf of the Marima and Temple, uh, its trustees and volunteers, please take cognizance of what the chair said. We are one Kutumbu, one big family, whether you say Indian, African. Let's now all put our hands together as the priest takes us through the prayer. We have some volunteers. You will see the raising of the flag. Now it's a tedious job. Now I'm not going to ask this lady to go up there or that young man. You may charge us later on if you get injured. So we'll all put our concerted energies positive towards the raising of the flag as they take us through the process. They start on the top and possibly one or two of you can help hold the cloth as it goes around. It's, they'll go in stages. You can assist by all touching hands and eventually it's positive energy that will transcend us into a better direction. Okay, Guru. As you see, some of us have gone beyond our sell by date, but they are still doing the job.
Supper will be served at your own homes. But today it's the mother's home. Please note supper will be served at after the prayer function. So don't go home hungry. Next button. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 